guys, today's video I'm going to be doing a thrift store haul. I'm so excited. If you guys don't know, I recently opened up a blog. It's called The Shy Girl's Guide to Growing Up. It's actually part of my marketing class. So if you want to help out my lovely GPA, feel free to check it out. I'm doing a post all about how to find really good thrift stores in New York City, along with my thrifting tips, along with just how to, in general, budget and still be able to buy things that you like that are really cute. So if you want to check out the blog post that is in collaboration with this video, it'll be linked down below. I also did a vlog while we were thrift shopping when my sister was here in the city so if you want to check that out it's at Michelle out of Rochelle also have a card right here you can click my name is Michelle and if you don't know I live in New York City so I recently hit up Williamsburg and I found so many good thrift finds I've never found like this many good things at once I'm pretty sure that's kind of all I have to say so if you like thrifting let me know your favorite thrift store down below and let's just go ahead and get right into this video first we went to Crossroads which is in Williamsburg and they had some great stuff I first found this Zara shirt and it's still pretty cold in New York City it's like 35 today so I don't know right jumpsuit but it's from Zara it's just like a cropped sweater and it's really really fuzzy and soft and it has this really cute collar that has like black trim on it and then also it has the black trim on the short sleeves and so I love this I think that this is great for class because I have to wear business casual so I thought this top would be really cute and this was only about $15 I think and it feels basically new I got this dress which is actually from forever 21 originally but it's just like this denim dress and it's kind of like shredded around the top and around the short sleeves and then it is frayed at the ends as well I thought that this would be so cute with just like some Converse or even some like tan booties and tights if it's still a little too cold in New York City. I love simple little dresses like this. So I thought this was so cute and I believe this was only like $9 so it was pretty cheap. Lastly at Crossroads I got this dress. This was I think the most expensive thing that I got but it is from Tommy Hilfiger and it just says Hilfiger on it and it's like this sweatshirt kind of dress and I love this i live for stuff like this i think it's so comfy just with some high top converse running errands around the city i think that this is going to be so nice if you want to see how i style these things make sure to follow me on instagram it's at michelle reed i think this was like 22 dollars. i got this pair of jeans also at crossroads and these are actually wet because i just washed them and so i didn't want to stick them in the dryer so these are going to be kind of like Cold to try on obviously these are gonna be like not everyone's style but they're originally from Zara I got these for I think $20 but they have a little like floral print on them they're so cute and they're very distressed and then at the bottom they do like a fringe detail at the bottom which looks weird right now because it's wet but it's really cute when they're dry I promise these are so cute I haven't worn low-rise jeans in forever and these literally like, came with a tag on them and so these were never worn and they were 20 bucks from Zara which I think is a good price so there's actually a Goodwill and I think this was the one really close to Washington Square Park. So many good things in it, but I got this dress which is the brand Tokyo Fashion Co. I've never heard of it, but it's this really cute spring dainty floral dress. It's so girly and it has the prettiest like hem at the bottom and it's just so flowy and cute. I'm like a total girly girl so I live for stuff like this. I just think it is so pretty for spring. I posted this picture on my Instagram and I think it's really cute. Truly Madly Deeply which I think is from PacSun I'm pretty sure but it's just like this army green dress. It's really simple. This is like one of my favorite colors. I just think that it's a really pretty color when you're tan and it basically ties around the waist. It's about like a midi size but I think this is so cute and I'm so excited to wear this. It warms up in New York City with some tennis shoes. I think this will be really cute. I posted a picture of this skirt on my Instagram. You guys were going crazy asking where it was from and it has no brand on it so I have no idea. It is this gingham wrap skirt. It is beautiful. It has ruffles on the bottom. You guys know I love me a good wrap skirt and so this is like so modest and pretty it really reminds me of Kristen John's something like this and so I totally picked this up and this is like me in a skirt I think it's so cute and I love it and it was only $15 which is a steal even though I don't know what the brand is I forgot which store I got this shirt from but it's really really plain it's just this button-down shirt and it's white and it's like really thin this also doesn't have a brand but it's really simple 
I have a habit of buying pants, dresses, and skirts, but I never buy tops, as you can see from this video. So I thought this would be good just to have, I think, tucked into high-waisted, light-wash jeans. This will be a really cute top to have. We finished off with No Relation Vintage, and guys, I found a pair of overalls. I've been wanting to find overalls for such a long time, and I can never find ones that fit me right. This pair is so cute. It's just like a really classic, it looks like something you buy from Madewell. Um, pair of overalls it has like little patches on it. It's the brand Cherokee. I think it might be like a kid's jumpsuit. It's a large, but it's pretty small. It also has really cute rose gold detailing on it. I love this. I think this is $18, which is such a good price for like overalls. And I think that it is so cute. And I cannot wait to wear this in Texas in the summertime or in the springtime here if it warms up anytime soon. These last two things I'm just throwing in. These weren't thrifted, but I ordered these from Dote. If you don't know what Dote is, it's an online shopping app. You've heard my spiel. Use my code Michelle and you will get $5 off, which is a seal. I'll have it linked down below if you want to download it. I bought these two pairs of Madewell pants. The first ones, these are their Cali denim jeans and they basically button up and then at the bottom they flare out. I'm so over skinny jeans. I'm so ready to wear like some wide pants. And so I think that these are so cute and they're comfortable, they're dark wash, and I love these. They're pretty pricey, but they're really great quality jeans. And this pair, I like cannot even believe. I think they're adorable. It's this plaid pair of pants. They are just really simple. They look like kind of like graph paper. And then at the bottom, they are super duper wide cut. And these are adorable. I got these and a size 24 tall. They run pretty true to size to your jean size. And so I really like these. I'm 5'7", so I usually get the tall pairs of pants from Madewell because I like my pants a little bit longer. Um, but these are so cute. I think they're gonna be so adorable with like some Keds and like a bodysuit tucked in, walking around New York City. So cute. So those are all the things that I thrifted slash got from Madewell. I'm sorry I slid those in, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, leave down below what your favorite thrift store is because I'd definitely be interested in knowing. And if you want to keep up with me more, be following my blog and also be following my vlog channel because I'm posting on there way more than I post on here. I love you guys and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye friends.